could try it that way but you guys wouldn't be able to really see me too well so um it's currently 12 47 so roughly 13 more minutes into my interview but i did want to talk about i don't know i i just wanted to talk okay i grew up in poverty i wouldn't say i was born into poverty because i i don't remember <laughs> if you see a glare it's because of my necklace so bear with me um but i basically grew up in poverty i'm still in poverty and i turned 30 last month okay um i'm at this age where well it's been like this for a few years a couple of years i don't want to say like a few years it's more like recent years maybe two two years where my goal is I'm trying whatever I can to get out of poverty, okay? And to have more of a comfortable life financially. And whether it's multiple streams of income, whether it's having multiple, like one job physically going out and working, you can't see my hand, I'm talking with my hand. And having a job where I work from home or whatever, I wanna do whatever I can to be comfortable because when you live month to month like me and by the middle of the month you're broke it's very discouraging i guess you want to say it's very depressing and hawaii if you make i don't i want to just say roughly three hundred thousand dollars a year you're probably comfortable and if you're making anywhere less than that then way less than that then it sucks okay and I thought about up and moving, but I need a place to stay. I need money. I need a job. I need all these things that would require a move. My little bird just flew in the coffee shop. But anyway, being in poverty sucks, and I know there's a life there for me that is much better than the one I'm currently living. Okay. Um. I know money doesn't bring happiness. But it can fix a way a lot of problems that I have been being poor and in poverty, okay? So people may say it doesn't bring you happiness, but when you're in poverty, it can fix a lot of things for anybody. Alright? And I'm one of them. Um it can pay off my debt, it can pay off whatever debt I have, buy things that we need, even meet our wants. That's why I'm so pushy on, I mean, I haven't been too pushy on social media, but that's one of the reasons why I keep doing social media, because in 2022, I made almost $1,000 in U.S. money just on social media. And it may not be a lot for some, but it's a lot for me. And when I was with Calvin Klein, luckily I was getting like one day a week, four hours, and that's why like less than 50 bucks. So I would use that money to pay off one of my credit cards, you know? So, yeah, this is just a frustration. I mean, I, I I need to start getting my thoughts that I have written down on paper so I can actually do them. Especially with social media. There's so much ways I can possibly make money on social media, you know. But time is it. Okay, I need to start going into my interview. But from time to time, I will have talkative vlogs like this where I just need to vent share my thoughts share my opinions share whatever and yeah i mean yeah okay wish me luck